the question would be find molarity of water at 4 degrees Celsius given the density is 1 gram per cc. Now you might be wondering, there is no solution in this. There is just a solvent. So how can you find the molarity of a solution when there is no solute? There is just water. So the thing is that we assume that the water is the solvent as well as solute. The water is taken to be the solvent as well as the solute. So by this what we can see is that its density is 1 gram per cc. Now from density we get this always approach like this. It's 1 gram per cc. So 1 gram of water will be its volume would be 1 centimeter cube per cc or you can say 1 milliliter per cc is equal to milliliter. Its volume would be 1 milliliter. So if you want to find the weight of the water in 1000 milliliter that is 1 liter how much would it be 1000 gram so it's 1000 gram in 1000 milliliter and this is 1 liter so you have 1 liter solution because water is the solute solvent and and it's also the solution because if it's both then it has to be the solution also so you have 1 liter solution and you have 1000 gram of water that means 1000 gram of solute. Now to find the molarity we need the number of moles in 1 liter solution. So if, if it's 1000 gram in 1 liter solution then how much will be the number of moles? 1000 not 10,000 1000 divided by 18 because 18 is the molecular weight of water. So 1000 by 18 will give you the number of moles of water in 1 liter of water and this comes out to be 55.55 moles in 1 liter. So the molarity, how, how did we define it? The number of moles in 1 liter of solution. So here we directly now got 55.55 moles in 1 liter solution. So its molarity would be 55.55 molar. This is the unit is moles per liter or you call it molar and it's denoted by M. So molarity of water would be 55.55 molar. You can have unlimited number of questions from this and this is there, that is there, calculate, molarity, calculate, molarity. But let me generalize the questions. Let me say the density of a solution is D. The molecular weight of solute 
is n maybe and then you have to find the relation between molarity and molality this molarity is capital m molarity is small m. so two things are given and you have to find the relation that means molarity is this 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 much into molality and that this 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 much would be in terms of d and mw so what do we do and this is d gram for cc let's give it so the density is d gram per cc so d gram of solute is present in one cc solution hmm? not solute uh, yes this is very important thing last time we had only water so we so, uh, we told that d gram of water is present in one cc but here we have a whole solution we have a solute as well as a solvent so this d gram would be the whole weight of solution so d gram of solution is present in 1 cc solution now we need to separate this d into the weight of sol solute and weight of solvent because we need them separately to find the number of moles of both so let us assume that there are x gram solute and y gram solvent not y you can just take it as d minus x so x gram of solute is present in 1 cc and d minus x gram of solvent is present in the same 1 cc of solution so what would be the so if you can say that x gram of solute is present in 1 cc so in 1000 cc that is in 1 liter 1000 x gram of solute would be present and if you want to convert it into the number of moles you have to divide it by the molecular weight of the solute which is mw so what would its molarity molarity be the number of moles of solute now by dividing this gram has changed to moles and this is the number of moles of solute in 1 liter so our molarity m would be 1000 x by mw so this is equation 1 we have to get another equation because this x we have taken we don't want it the answer in terms of x so to eliminate this x we need another equation and also to introduce molality we need another equation 